you ask him a question, do I? Hey, yo. What is magic? Uh, I've never thought about it at all, actually. I mean, it's a big part of my life, but with no answer coming to mind, I kept my mouth shut. Can't think of anything. I can't think of a good answer now. That's fine for now. We still have plenty of time to find one. Yours. We've got some rooms to go. Take the time to search for the answer with, from within your heart to find out the magic is in you. Yes, sir. Once, one more thing. Now, this is very important. You must not leave the academy grounds after nightfall. Also, the Tower of Sorrow and the surrounding East Forest must never be entered. The Tower of Sorrow? Isn't that from the fairy tale from, Dragon, from the Dragon of Time and the First King? The fairy tale, you say? Isn't it? That's not a fairy tale, but history. But really? That actually happened? <laughs> Indeed, yes. Though so, some men still believe it is more than a fairy tale, it seems. The three mages have been succeeded by the best mages. Huh? The three mages have been succeeded by the best mages of each generation for the past two thousand years, protecting the Tower of Sorrows. Oh wait, this is the wrong guy. I think our head, our headmaster is one of the successors of these mages. Let's go. What? He's one of the three mages? My mouth got open in amazement. Indeed, I am. He smirked playfully with a quick wink. Uh, so, so lightly. <laughs> that is all I have to say for now, Demi. Do you have any other questions? Yep. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Nope. Oh, there you go. Uh, yeah. I just remembered about the school emblem that I found yesterday in my pocket. Yesterday I found someone's emblem. Here is the emblem. I took it out of I took it out from my pocket and showed it to the headmaster. I showed it to the headmaster. I think someone lost it. Hmm, let me see. He picked up the emblem from my hand, having a careful look at it. Then he gave it back to me with a big smile. <clears throat> this is yours, so keep it. Uh, but I've already got mine on. Listen, Deborah. Everything happens for either a reason or a circumstance. The envelope seems to be destined to be yours. It has happened for a reason. You'll soon find out the true meaning of this, so keep up good until then. But, uh, yes, sir. I wanted to ask him more questions, but he said I should discover the answer myself. Well, then. Is, is that all good? Is, is that all you want to ask? Yes, sir. Good. Enjoy learning here at the yeah, this academy, Endeavor. Thank you, sir. So it was um, finally. So this is it. Finally, my new life is about to start at this academy. I will definitely pass the trial and become an official student for sure. 
I bowed to the headmaster Walt and Professor Snape as I reformed my de determination. Then I left the headmaster's room. My butt hurts. Got, got skewed up on my chair a little bit. Uh, when I entered the classroom, it was filled with students. Uh, pleasant chatter. With a cheerful atmosphere, the room with a cheerful atmosphere in the room, uh, my nervousness was melted away, and I could hardly wait to take a class. Wow! Are they all wizards, aren't they? They're all wizards, aren't they? I hope I can get along with them. Are you the new student? Uh, yes, I am. Suddenly, a uh, gallant boy with golden blonde hair talked to me. Well, wow, he's such a not so handsome guy because I think Randy's handsome. Uh, I've heard about you already. I'm Al Goldstein. Nice to meet you. I'm Debbie Danger. Nice to meet you too. Uh, you may take a seat wherever you want. Thank you. Suddenly, a male scan is having a mature uh, look uh, with love. Okay, hold on. Uh, suddenly, a male student having a mature, handsome look with a long hair joined our conversation. He was wearing a dazzling green earring on his right ear. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can do this. Hold on. Nice to meet you, too. I'm surprised that you're here for a morning. Well, I wanted to meet new students, especially when you're in the car that was crawling, you know? How did you smell that out? Uh, I somehow could see a spark, a, a spark cracking between, uh, between two. Uh, I think they're not getting on well with each other. Uh, right. mm, yeah. The bell will ring soon. Are you going to take? Uh, so take a seat right now, Lil. Oh, it's not ready to go away. Then Lil left the classroom. Um. So he's skipping class again. Um, is he act? Is he acting like that always? Does he always act like that? Yeah, well, forget about him. You should take a seat and get ready for class. Mm. Just then, the bell rang out through the classroom. Everybody immediately took their seats. Where should I sit? Uh, looking around the room, I found an empty seat. It's, uh, my seat might be a good spot. I took a seat by the window. Then I found a male student with an eye patch sitting behind, uh, yeah, behind my seat. Good morning, I'm Debbie Danger, the new student today. Nice to meet you. He was blankly uh, looking outside of the window and didn't reply to me, neither giving me a glance. No, giving me a glance. 